Y'all put this girl on a bench where she ain't even dead yet. The girl ain't even dead. Welcome to Burbank TV Reactions. Let's get right into it. A couple days ago, FYBJ Maine went live and addressed a the shooting death of Chicago rapper Little Scoom. We just go go ahead and jump right into it. No for no. We live or what? For no. Hey, let's start that. Can y'all hear me now? Is is my whoop still tweaking or is I'm decent? I'm fucking now. Let, let's cause we finna let's break this shit down, bro. Let let let's start the Hey look bro, I I guess I guess my whoop D Hey uh, y'all notice he he talk out the side of his mouth a lot. I was always taught growing up, never trust never trust nobody who talk out the side of their mouth. Listen, uh, so so Y'all know we we trying to uh um, we trying to end on phone now. We we gonna try to do our best on phone my best to end. Y'all know I've been pushing this peace movement, bro. Let's just let's just start down the peace movement that Jay Man got going on, bro. The biggest movement Chicago Chicago ever seen on Fulton Gray. But what we seeing? We know y'all did y'all homework on 63rd. We know y'all did y'all homework on. The old blockians. Let let just let just be <laughs> facts. The old blockians. Um, but what we seeing right now after me and Dirt, cause I already told y'all, bro. Anybody else who out here still whooping on phone number? Y'all seen me and Dirt come together with that conversation? That was the biggest shit Chicago ever seen. It's merch. Y'all still whooping? It's merch. Y'all heard me and Dirt? It's merch. Y'all still whooping? Lock they ass up. Y'all still want to kill people? Lock, Lock they, they ass up. up. Lock they ass up. It hit different. Lock they ass up. Hey, for real though. Hey, that's what Chicago need, man. Hey, they, 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 I don't, Chicago PD, PD, it seemed like to me like they just letting them off each other. They ain't doing it. It seemed like they do the littlest investigation possible. The only reason they got the old block five is because of where it happened and the FBI got involved. So, I mean, I mean, some of this, some of that got to fall on the Chicago police too. Hey, I'm going to commend him for what he trying to do. If he really trying to push the peace, but at the same time, bro, you can't be on here talking about you trying to push the peace and you still talking, still keeping this stuff in your music, like the, uh, the dissing and the, the sliding, the sliding and stuff. You know what I mean? Y'all seen me and Dirk just, just come together and end all this bullshit. Why is y'all still out here whooping? Y'all making obituaries over, put it like this. Let's just, let's just speak facts. All this set up back door shit, we gotta get rid of that. But y'all can't be putting shit on somebody's name and we don't, we don't know the, we don't know the facts. We don't know the proof. Y'all put this girl on a bench where she ain't even dead yet. The girl ain't even dead. What? They talk about, he talk about uh, Lil Scoom's girlfriend. And like, supposed, supposedly, they, uh, she set him up. That's what the, I guess that's what the streets of Chicago was saying. But like he said, you don't know all the facts. What if that ain't the case? Somebody already done shot up her house from what, what I heard from another video. I right, y'all whooping like this. We pushing a piece. Put it like this. We seen, we seen all this shit. Put it like this. All us got dead people that we know, bro. Our looks, bro. We all victim of this shit here in Chicago, bro. Like, let's just speak facts. On phone numbers, some of us don't know how to deal with the pain, so some of us crash out. See, look, crashing me, out is not the Brooks way. Next. Guess it who different. Groups. That's see, that's wild. Y'all see, we trying to us as being the older generation. We trying to, we trying to. Hey, I don't know. Back in back in my generation, like where I'm from, we don't have like gangs per se like that, like they do in Chicago. I'm from the Midwest too, but not the Chicago area. We have we what we have what we had when I was growing up and what we still have is just like clicks of D boys that's clicked up and they all war against each other, you know what I'm saying? So 
I mean, I don't really know too much about this of this whole Chicago gang stuff, but I know like any any gangsters I know, they don't be killing girls like that, bro. And you just seen like right there on the screen, they was threatening the uh, they was threatening the, the girlfriend's friend that was supposedly there. Set an example. Me and Dirk try to come together. Y'all know what's going on. Y'all see, we tried to put our differences so aside. In so that was big. Y'all seen how many people Dirk done lost his whole life? Y'all seen how many people J. Main done lost his whole life, bro? Y'all think that was easy for us to try to come together and even have that conversation? Y'all think that's something Dirk wanted to do, bro? Y'all gotta understand, bro. Hey, I guarantee a lot of the people that's on these comments uh, talking about they about they love crashing out and all this kind of stuff. I guarantee they ain't even from Chicago. They probably from a whole another state, living in some kind of suburb, sitting there in a, in, in a mama's house in the suburbs, typing up shit, trying to keep the shit going because they think it's entertaining. Bro, when you lose somebody, bro, it's hard, bro. It's hard. We know that shit hard, bro. Um, now with these new situations. What we seeing, bro? We seeing y'all gonna do the same shit that was done before y'all, bro. Now we see the shorties out here crashing out. We seeing the shorties dying. Young, young ages, bro. This shit ain't right. This shit ain't cool. That shit ain't funny, bro. This side of that side. Ain't no sides. We all from the rack, bro. Y'all last be tweaking, bro. On phone them. Y'all ain't seeing this example that's in y'all fucking face, bro. Y'all put this girl on the obituary. That's why. Y'all put this girl That's on the obituary, bro. This how y'all whooping? We don't know if she set up anybody. We, don't, we ain't even got her side of the story. Let the police do their job. Y'all trying to do the police job. The internet needs to stop doing that shit. Stop whooping. Y'all put the little girl on the obituary, bro. She not even dead, bro. Let's just, let just strike them. She ain't even tell us that. We don't know all the facts. Stop trying to do the police job. Stop. Yeah. What if that girl end up dead, bro? What if this little girl end up dead? If she do end up dead, whoever whoever made the obituary and put it out, that's going to be the first person they look at. So they was dumb for doing that. That was real stupid. Really stupid. And Hold on. My thing is, y'all be out here like... <laughs> Killing each other and stuff, man. But but people like George Zimmerman still walking around. Like, peacefully. Like, he walking around with no hesitation. And I'm not saying go and do something to the dude, but, like, seriously. Let's just speak facts. They still out here killing motherfuckers? Lock they ass up. Lock they yeah, ass up. already came together. It hit different. Lock they ass up. Y'all still want to act like y'all ain't got no fucking sense? Lock they ass up. Y'all still whooping? Lock they ass up. It hit different. Y'all, y'all that's, y'all that's put this girl on the, on the bitch bro a obituary is crazy y'all speaking shit into existence we don't know these facts long live to everybody who done died in the rack bro everybody bro we always tricked bro what the y'all ain't you hear what he said you hear what he said right he said they always tricked i want y'all to think about that statement where they be getting these uh, switches and stuff from? Shit, Rondo had a had a what? Had a, uh, a RPG, bro. I'm a military veteran. I would have trouble getting an RPG. So where is they getting it from? Where are they getting switches from? Huh? They getting that shit? They getting it from the, yeah the government handing that stuff out. See. See, I, like I said, I'm not from Chicago area. I don't know too much about the Chicago gang and the politics and stuff. But I do know the, 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 the government thought it was a good idea to go ahead and cut the heads 
off of these snakes that they, these gangs that they call them snakes, and they think the body gonna die with it. Nah, it just you just unleashing all these little these little kids, and you done took their fathers away, locked them up, or killed them. So they growing up without fathers, but they still in that gang life, and they just running around wild killing each other. That's the government's mo, actually. If you think about it, we go invade Iraq, cut the head off the snake, take out Saddam Hussein and his uh, bath party or whatever, and then you got insurgents just running around, just doing whatever now. It's the same thing in Chicago. It's the same thing in Chicago. Matter of fact, wasn't it a military dude that got busted uh, selling uh, switches to, to one of the gangs in Chicago? Y'all ain't learned nothing yet, bro. Y'all ain't doing nothing but doing their work for them. Y'all ain't learned nothing yet. Y'all whooping, bro. If y'all if y'all whooping black people, bro, y'all want to be known as savages and menaces and shit like that and devils and dick. Yeah, so y'all know that's his stuff messing shit. up my mind. Lock their ass up. Lock they ass up. I'm tired of this shit. It hit different. Y'all want to be demons and whatever else. Hey, go to the military. They'll train you and pay you to be a demon. And you can do it legally. Why, why be out in the streets trying to be a demon? Hurting your own people. Bringing down your own neighborhoods. I put motherfuckers on obituaries and they ain't dead. It different. It different. This shit is going too far. We just seen the boy interview on DJU. He was talking about how all his friends died at a young age. That's wild. We have to stop this shit. We gotta stop this shit. Ain't nobody. Hold on. You mean to tell me you made it this far in the video and still haven't subscribed to the channel? Man, hit that subscribe button. Make sure you hit the bell icon. That way you get notified every time I drop a new video. And while you're down here, you might as well go ahead and hit the thumbs up. That way this video gets pushed out even further. Help us reach our goal of 10,000 subscribers. I want to thank you in advance. Now, back to your regular scheduled programming. Advocating for stopping this bullshit. I'm advocating for stopping this shit. It hit different. They done put this, I don't know the little girl. I don't know the, the boys on either side who who involved or whatever the case is, but I know we all black, we from Chicago, and we is dying. We is dying. We Chicago niggas and bitches, because y'all involved too. Let's start there. It start with the stories like this, these back door ass stories, and now you see niggas talking about I can't even get my hat did. It ain't different. Break this shit down. Y'all killing everybody in Chicago is crazy. I'ma keep whooping like this because this the shit y'all need to hear. Cause y'all fucked up. Yeah, you. Bitch, you fucked up. Nigga, you too. Y'all fucked up, bro. How we let this shit get this far, bro? How did y'all let this shit get this far, bro? Why is y'all whooping like this? Switches? Switches? See, told y'all. Switches, bro. You can't even aim with that shit, Sure as fuck can't. Y'all shooting up everybody in these parties. Shooting up everybody on these blocks. Fuck they and totally missed the target. Totally missed your intended target, but hit everything else, though. Because you out here trying to use a switch to get one person. That's a, that's, that's a force of suppressing. Y'all know what I'm trying to say. So I don't know, homie. You making me sus... Uh, sus... Suspicious, it's, eh? It's making me think a lot. Smart guy. That's for suppressing a, a whole crowd, not just one person. Hey, ass up. It different. Lock them up. It different. It different. <laughs> then, this shit, y'all do this shit here in Chicago, and what happened? It get the reciprocating all over, all over the United States. That's what what we is. We the trend setting city, bro. 
They gonna do what we do, bro. It hit different when they gonna do what the fuck we do. So they see us whooping like that, you gonna see somebody else in another state get back though. Cause what you see, you what you see, bro, you see us push the piece here and they start pushing the piece in New York, bro. Told you, it see, New York. Hey, and that's crazy because back in the day, it used to be New York. Everybody like on this side of the country followed New York, especially before uh, the West Coast started heating up in hip hop for real. Everybody used to follow New York. But now for some reason, with this gang stuff, New York following Chicago. So we got to keep doing positive whoops here, bro. All this, it, I know it's the summertime. Y'all get irritated. These kids, y'all need to go play hopscotch, bro. Y'all get out and do something. Playing with switches and shit, bro. Go play some football. Y'all don't have PlayStations. Do we need to do? Do go we need to get? Basketball. Do y'all got still got y'all PS phones and shit? Do y'all got games, bro? It hit different. What's going on? Go listen. But let me tell y'all what's going on here. That's why we trying to push this piece and stop this violence, bro. Cause what we know, we seen. Let's just break this shit all the way down, bro. We seen people, us as for us artists around Chicago, we seen us, what we do in our songs. We diss the dead, bro. That's why we got to end that trend. Dissing niggas, dead homies, dissing each other. We got to end that, that shit lame for them. That shit lame, gang, on for them. Hey, you're not, you not supposed to be speak ill of the dead at all. Even if it is your biggest enemy, you're not supposed to do that because that, that come back on you. And you see a lot of times this come back on these, especially on these Chicago rappers, come back on them in different ways. You know what I'm saying? Like Dirk. I like Dirk's music. But, bro, you got you to gotta chill. And I understand y'all done been through some things. Look, I'm an Iraq war veteran, combat veteran. I understand y'all done been through some things. Y'all done got put through some things. Y'all done seen some things. And it changed y'all whole mind, y'all perspective on things. Some of y'all, some of y'all just don't care, but 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 y'all got stuff to lose for, man. Or y'all got stuff to lose. You got kids, you got a mama, you got sisters, brothers. Get at especially y'all that's doing it in the hip hop now. Get that street life up, man. Especially if you in Chicago. I don't my one my favorite rappers here recently was Mo3. Should have left Dallas. Should have left Dallas. If y'all, if you a promising rapper and you you about you think you about to make it, get out of you from Chicago. Get out of Chicago, man. Get out of Chicago. Cause what's that's gonna do? You dissing motherfuckers that you barely you catch my that shit lame, folk. This nigga mama, this nigga family. You ain't. And, and another thing, these rappers gotta stop putting in the music. That's what it is because a lot of these little dudes. They they hearing this in the music. They seeing y'all with the jewelries and with the jewelry in the music. They see y'all holding the Drakes, right? And they thinking, okay, well, they want to be they want to be a rapper too. They want to get paid too. So they gotta they they gotta be authentic. They gotta hit the they gotta do this street life. They gotta jump off the porch. Feel me? And that ain't the truth. Hey, a lot of a lot of these older school rappers, especially from like my generation, they ain't do half the stuff that they be rapping about. We just did the video on what Charleston White was saying about Bun B. He an entertainer. Jay-Z, entertainer. All of them, all of them be talking. We see what was going on with Drake. We all knew Drake was fake, though. You know what I mean? <laughs> he not like us. Just hurting that dumb people. You got to think about the people that's around them who that shit affecting, bro. It hit different. They think this shit GTA, bro. Yeah, I think this shit GTA for real, bro. That shit lame, bro. It hit different, bro. Bro. These are that obituary, bro. That obituary is crazy, bro. That uh, obituary, bro. A uh, obituary, bro. But put it like this: some people getting that now, J man. Let's break this shit down. Let let's break this shit down. She she deserved this, so she deserved that, bro. Y'all don't know all the facts, bro. Y'all not the police, bro. That's what I'm trying to tell y'all. Stop saying what somebody deserve, bro. Stop saying what y'all think somebody deserve. Y'all don't know shit, bro. Y'all don't know the facts, bro. Half of y'all don't even know these people. Y'all seeing this shit on the internet. It hit different. Stop whooping like that. Stay out of whatever the fuck they got going on. Because obviously that's some real shit they got going on. Stop whooping like that, bro. 
It hit different. All these kids ending up, and when I say kids, bro, if they 21, 22, and under, bro, they kids, bro. Kid. Let, us, let us speak facts. That's I know a, a lot kid. of y'all feel like y'all grown. Don't know nothing about nothing. Oh, now, y'all last 21, 22, y'all last kids, bro. All they ass steady down, bro. This shit, this shit, this shit, this shit doing something to me, bro. Stop whooping like that. It's like, y'all seen what we did in our generation and, and y'all repeating that shit, bro. And on four them, do y'all homework on all the dead homies that J-Main got. I'm not finna let y'all go down this route, bro. I'm not finna let y'all whoop like this, bro. I can't let y'all whoop like this on four them. Bro, he did that. My homie them that did the my homie them and they homie them did the dying for y'all, bro. We trying to save the younger generation, folk. Y'all is tweaking, gang. Y'all last over tweaking, folk. Let's just speak facts, bro. We gonna end this shit, bro. Y'all, y'all, y'all last chasing it, folk. Y'all, y'all did y'all homework on chasing this shit on four them. You make y'all people's prize, bro. It's different. It's different jobs that niggas can have out here. It's different. It's other resources, bro. Facts, bro. Facts. Hey, you could go to you can go to CDL school seven, eight weeks and in two years be making 100K. You don't even need a high school diploma for that, for real. Hey, if you even if, if you got the money and you could go out and get your own truck and get you and get your own authority and stuff, you could be making that right out the gate. You know what I'm saying? You ain't got to be in these streets. There's plenty of jobs out there. You can go be an electrician, a plumber, yeah, and be running your own stuff. Have your own work hours. Be your own boss. Make your own money. I know um, our generation taught y'all, you dish your ops, you might get on, get a bag, and get out the way, bro. On folk, we need to find another way. We need to start another trend, folk. It hit different. Um, it hit different. It's a lot of these Chicago art. Steady dying, that steady person, bro. I wonder where he at, where his uh, stuff this shit, This shit crazy, bro. Let's just speak facts, bro. We don't know the situation, bro. Um, I heard um, the, the brother who passed, bro, they say he was in the basketball. This shit crazy. It hit different. So it's like, you don't, you don't, y'all don't be knowing the whole stories. Y'all just see this one side that people, y'all see the internet side of them on phone them. These people got family. When I, when I, when I click off this live, bro, y'all was seeing J Man. I got a daughter, bro. I got a family, bro. I got people that love me too, bro. It hit different. It hit different when they in the comments getting that R.I.P. Chicago, bro. Y'all steady whooping like this, bro. Now I just had to put. Say Aunt Glizzy bullied you. It hit different. Shit on y'all head. I see all this shit. They got the girl Nene and uh, they made an obituary about her. They they getting see, that uh, not a new trend in Chicago. Is he tried to do something positive? They down there in the comment section trolling him. Like why? Why he trying to do pos something positive for his city though? Don't get knee knee. I'm just back though. Shit cool. We in that shit, bro. Um, uh, let's just speak facts, bro. Um, uh, some of y'all just playing. Hold on, let me see. With it, let me see what's seriously. What, oh, hold on. Yeah, see, now my time, my time done, done ran out. It's time. It's what are you I, gotta go. I gotta go. I gotta go. All right, that's enough of uh, J May. What, what my boy on J Pay? <laughs> hey, I hope y'all enjoyed today's video. I'm Charm, BurbankClothing.com. If you made it this far, please, please subscribe to the channel. Hit that bell icon. That way you can get notified every time I drop a new video. The goal is to hit 10,000 subscribers. We still love, we still a small channel. We just try to grow into a, a bigger, smaller channel now. You know what I'm saying? So do your boy a solid. Go ahead and hit that subscri subscribe button. Excuse me, I can't even talk right now. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Hit the bell icon. And while you're down there, hit that thumbs up button for me. I'm going to thank y'all in advance. But I'm up out of here. Peace.